Today we are going to learn about the forest and the wildlife of India. We all know that India has been a land of great forests. Nearly 67,000 hectares of Indian land has been covered with forest which has been the houses for variety of species. The biodiversity has been a significant feature of the Indian forests. Indian forests holds various varieties of mammals, flora and fauna which are found in the world. According to the statistics, we have 81,000 of fauna, 47,000 of flora. In that again, 47,000 of plants, we have 15,000 plants which are explicitly in the category of flowering spaces. So this variety of biodiversity is found only in India where 10% of the wild flora and 20% of the mammals are in danger. In India, we have various forest reserves prior to the rule of the Britishers. After the Britishers have entered, they have categorized the forest into different different categories like reserved forest, unreserved forest, protected forest. After the categorization happened, that resulted in the endangering of the forest. People are also closely associated with the forests. Some of the tribal communities feel that that forest is their motherland. They get everything from the forest. There are various moments also happen against the uh, removal of tribal communities rights from the forest lands. So in this unit we shall discuss what is the forest importance in our country, how the spaces are getting endangered, threat for the biodiversity in our country, how are the categorization of the species happened and then different kinds of forests and what are the steps taken to preserve the special animals. So being a land of great biodiversity from the past to the present India had various varieties of mammals, various varieties of plants, various varieties of insects, various varieties of plants in that also medicinal plants, non-medicinal plants, flowering plants all these have brought in the different varieties and made India the land of biodiversity. But today we have the entire category of plants and animals falling in the different categories. Let's find out what are the different categories. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on CBSE syllabus.